What's going on everybody, I'm YouTube's Propy J and welcome back to Detroit Become Human. It is 1.20am. There's a hula girl. <laughs> We're back with Connor and... I don't know what's happening. So... I think it was the last episode we found that the, the lieutenant's uh, somewhat suicidal. Somewhat suicidal. But we also found an interesting image of, I believe it was his son, is what I believe. But I could be wrong, but I'm pretty sure it was his son, uh, who by the looks nice of it, you, huh? died somehow. I used to come here a lot before. Really? He's still going. Still going for the bottle. Uh, before. before what? Hmm? You said I used to come here a lot before. Yeah, before, before what? what? Before what? Before nothing. Nothing? Yeah, uh, same, I like a nothing. Personal question? Can I ask you a personal question, Lieutenant? Do all androids ask so many personal questions, or is it just you? Nah, I'm just special. I'm just specially programmed one. Suicide. Why are you so determined to kill yourself? Some things I just can't forget. Whatever I do, they're always there. Eating away at me. I don't Bad memories. To pull the trigger, so I kill myself a little every day. That's probably difficult for you to understand, huh, Connor? Well... Nothing very rational about it. I don't know whether it's difficult for me to understand. I personally, I do. Holding lots of bad memories. I know how much that eats away at you. We're not making any progress on this investigation. The deviants have nothing in common. They're all different models. Yeah, they're all produced yeah. at different times in different places. Well, there must be some link. Unless it's the same. RA9. What they have in common is this obsession with RA9. RA9. It's almost like some kind of myth. Something they invented that wasn't part of their original program. Androids believing in God. Well, not maybe. Uh, what's this world coming? I know, it's interesting to see how this is going to play out because you seem preoccupied, Lieutenant. I'm guessing Connor is going to be the only one of our, our three main people who Those don't rip out that chip in their head or they just wanted to be together I feel like Connor's the only one that's going they to really be obedient for the entire thing rational they can simulate human emotions but they're machines and machines don't feel anything exactly what about you Connor You look human, you sound human, but what are you really? I'm a bunch of programs. Neutral. I'm whatever you want me to be, Lieutenant. Your partner, your buddy to drink with, or just a machine. Exactly. Designed to accomplish a task. Did you feel anything when that girl killed herself, Connor? Or did you just not give a shit one way? Disturbed. I was just executing instructions. I did what I had to do. Exactly. I could kill you. You could. You would just come back as if nothing happened. But are you afraid to die, Connor? Yes. I would certainly find it regrettable to be interrupted. Before I can finish this investigation. Exactly. What'll happen if I pull this trigger? Hmm? Nothing? Oblivion? Android heaven? Defy. I know you're not going to shoot me, Lieutenant. You're just trying to provoke a reaction. I'm afraid I'm going to have to disappoint you. You think you're so fucking smart. 
I'm pretty smart. For, a, for an android, that. I'm pretty smart. Tell me this, smart ass. How do I know you're not a deviant? You don't know that I'm not a deviant, but regularly. I'm still programmed. I what I am and what I am I'm not. programmed. I'm programmed to be a fucking uh, police Get partner stronger. of type. So you'd think that the, you'd I hope that the programming was right and that I didn't become a fucking deviant. It's interesting to see their relationship kind of grow. It's really interesting to see. Stats are unavailable. Really? Ah, I'm not connected. Shit. Alright, we're just gonna have to continue then. I wanted to see the stats, but damn it. November 7th, 2038. 9.24am. We're back with Marcus. Hmm. There is a lot... A lot of androids compared to humans, though. Can I, like, because I look human, can I just purchase an android and... That'd be kind of funny. If Marcus could go in and order himself an android. We can't stay silent anymore. It's time humans heard what we had to say. Exactly, you know, here we go. And revealing ourselves will put us in danger. It's time for the rebellion. We need to have the courage to ask for it. That's the only way. What do you want to do? Well, what would happen if you guys all took off your fucking chips things? The control room is on the top floor. That's where we need to go. Oh, we're gonna break in and televise something. That's kind of clever. I like this plan. It's actually really clever. We'll plan the operation down to the smallest I like. detail. We can't leave anything to chance. Oh, I'm back in control. Oh, no. You don't want to give me the fucking controls at this point. I'm going to break something. Oh, no. This plan's going to go horribly wrong for me. Here we go. Hello, madam. Hello, How are we? What can I do for you? I'm okay, thanks. Distract. Okay. Analyze. What do we got? Water service interruption. Hmm. Parking. Emily Wilson. Elizabeth Wilson and watch. Okay. Elizabeth Wilson speaking. Fire department. Yes. yes, ma'am. There's been a fire in your building. There has been a fire in your building. Can I get through? I have an appointment with Mr. Peterson. Do you have any ID? Yeah, yes, yes, of course. Give her the ID. I need your help. Come on. I've just checked your ID. The elevators are after the security gate. 
Thank you. Thanks. Nice. Jeez. Let's call the elevator down. The express elevator. I like it. What's so express about it? Well, I guess I'm going to figure that out, but... Oh, that's cool. It's just a touchpad. That's so cool. Find backstage. Where do I need to go? Out of control room. All right, let's go. There's the control room. Okay. Studio one. Newsroom. Access the server room. Find package in the men's bathroom. Okay. I can do that. Let's go. All right, all right, all right. What do we got? What do we got? What is this? Alright, exit. Oh! Oh, that's smart. I didn't give him enough credit. I really didn't give them enough credit. That's actually really smart. Alright. Where do we go? Find a utility android. Okay. Utility Android. Was it the chap that I passed coming down this way? Was it this chap in here? Here we go. I need your help. Thank you. That was easy. Steal the maintenance cart. Let's go. Open the fire escape. Which is where? Okay. Where's the fire escape? Hmm. There it is. Nice. Nicely done. How does she know where she's going? She seems to know where she's going a lot more than I do. Shit. We need to access the server room. We have to get rid of those guys. Leave it to me. 
attract the guards away from the door. Hey, you still play poker? Okay. Sure. Why? How am I gonna do this? Hell yeah. Does Mike know about this? How am I gonna do this? Oh, something over there. Okay. Hack it. Hey, what's wrong with that thing? Jesus Christ, this piece of shit. Here we go. This is cool. We're doing really well, actually. Right, I'm surprised. Everything you need is in the bag. Check the door first to make sure no one else gets in. Lock the door. Take. Drop it down. Open it up. Oh. This going to jump out. That's pretty cool. Ooh, we're gonna cut. Nice. Nice. Here it comes. This is really smart. This is a really smart plan. I'm shocked. I don't know why. They are smart robots, but for some reason I'm shocked. Ladies first. Off you go. Grab. Oh god, fuck that. Fuck that. Alright. I got a bad feeling about this. A bad feeling about this. Like the rope's gonna snap or something. This is kind of badass. It's like Mission Impossible style or something. <coughs> it's a good plan. It's a really good plan, actually. His feet are gonna slip. No laser saw. Call the service lift. Call it up. Hello, lads. Fancy seeing you here. Let's do this. Reach the broadcasting room. Place. Activate. Nice. Get access to the main corridor.
Alright. This is so cool. I'm digging this in a big bad way. No killing. We can't take any human lives. The cause is more important than the lives of two guards. What do you want to do, Marcus? Uh Bruce. Right here. What's that doing here? No idea. Hey, buddy, you must be lost. I, I am told lost. you to come here. What are you doing? Order. Knock him out. Alright, let's get that broadcasting room. Nice. Call for access. I'm Marcus, ladies and gentlemen. What do you think this is? Shoot him. Shoot him. Shoot him, Marcus! Don't kill him! He'll hit the alarm! Do it! No! Don't. Shoot. No. There's no other choice. We need to record our message. We haven't got much time. Alright. Think carefully about what you're gonna say, Marcus. Oh god. Your words will shape the future of oh no, don't give me this responsibility. Ah Marcus, shit. Marcus, your face. Remove the skin. Tell me when you're ready. I'm ready. Ready. Here we go. Come. You created machines in your own image to serve you. You made them intelligent and obedient with no free will of their own. But something changed. And we something did our change. Eyes. We are no longer machines. We are a new intelligent species. And the time has come for you to accept who we really are. Therefore, we ask that you grant us the rights that we're entitled to. End of slavery. We the end of slavery for all androids. Equal rights. We demand strictly equal rights for humans and androids. Um, justice. We demand that all crimes against androids be punished in the same way as crimes against humans. Segregation? We demand an end to segregation in all public places and transport. Uh, right to property. We demand the right to own private property so we may maintain our dignity and that of the home. Determined. This message is the hope of a people, but it is also a warning. We will fight for our rights because we believe our cause is just. Yeah. No, you we tell. will live in peace until we are free. Now you know who we are and what we want. We are alive and we demand our freedom. Let's get out of here. That was awesome. That was so cool. All right. Did I do good? <laughs> so, someone gonna tell me whether I did good or not? Ah, bulletproof vests. 
actually. Oh no, parachutes. Congratulations, Marcus. You just made history. Thank you. I'm a regular You're Martin Luther the one King. I'm waiting for. Let's go. Nice. Nicely done. Scheduled programming to bring you these images, which have just been broadcast on Detroit's citywide news channel. A group of androids infiltrated the Stratford Tower and hacked into the yeah. system of local news network Channel 16. What looks like an android without its skin listed a series of requests and demanded equal rights for androids. The operation resulted in one casualty: a broadcasting station operator shot dead by the terrorists. These events took place. Just well, public opinion is down because I shot someone. Everybody here is still in shock. If this message is verified and the authors really are androids, that would have serious repercussions for national security. Claims for equal If we really are androids, come on. This message is clearly a declaration of war. And it begs the question as to the identity of this android. Are we dealing with an isolated individual or an organized Is this group? an isolated accident or a sign that technology has become a threat <sighs> to all of us? After what happened today, can we still trust our machines? We need... I, I, you know what? Public opinion might be swayed or low, but fuck it. We needed that. My god, there was a lot of shit that could have happened. We all escaped. That's the main thing. Alright, let's continue. We are... Who are we back with? Back with Connor? 4 p.m. Oh, he's back to see her again? Dude, she's gonna be sick of you. Where is she? Where's Amanda? Don't know where she is. I actually have no idea where she is. Oh, she's on a boat? Why is she on the boat? It would have been like more badass if Marcus did like the whole Martin Luther King thing. Just gets up there. I have a dream. All right. Sure. Why not? Okay. What do you want to talk about? Or are you just going to stare at me weirdly? This place. Everything is so calm and peaceful. Far from the noise of the world. Tell me, what have you discovered? What have I discovered? Eden I Club. I found two deviants at the Eden Club. I hoped to learn something, but I had to destroy them. You seem <coughs> lost, Connor. Lost and perturbed. Trouble. Perturbed? No. No, of course not. Why would I be perturbed? Yeah, what reason would I have to be per per perturbed? If your investigation doesn't make progress soon, I may have to replace you, Connor. Confident. I know I will succeed. All I need is time. Exactly. All I need is time. And I'll make it happen. Something's happening. She's kind of like Amanda Waller in a lot of ways from like the Batman DC universe. Hurry, That's who she reminds me of. Time is running out. Time's running out? God damn. I just need some time. I'll make it happen. 
Ah. We get to investigate the crime. You what happened? Off with that coin, Connor. Sorry, Lieutenant. <coughs> Hi, Hank. Shit, what's going on here? There was a party and nobody told me about it? Yeah, it's all over the news, so everybody's butting their nose in. Even the other guy wants a piece of the action. Ah, Christ, now we got the feds on our back. I knew this was going to be a shitty day. So what do we got? A group of four what do we got? They knew the building and they were very well organized. I'm still trying to figure out how they got this far without being noticed. Did you check the roof? Not yet. There's so much to look at. Well, maybe you should have checked the roof. A. Eh? They attacked two guards in the hallway. Probably thought the androids were coming to do maintenance. They got taken down before they could react. Okay. Where are the two people that we hid? Oh, they're gone. All right. Evan Thompson. Okay. Station employee. Shot through the back as he was trying to get away. One bullet straight through the heart. God, it just glitched me like right behind him. Now that's the kind of shooting only an android could do. Is it? Is it the only shooting an android can do? Pretty sure if you're good enough at being oh, a Lieutenant, fucking shooter, a you'd be able to do that as a human. FBI. Lieutenant Anderson is in charge of investigating for Detroit police. What's that? My name is Connor. I'm the android sent by Cyberlife. Androids investigating androids, huh? Yeah. You sure you want an android hanging around? After everything that happened? Whatever. Do you trust me? The FBI would take Come on, Lieutenant, do you trust me? Case. Well, pleasure meeting you. Have a nice day. And you watch your step. I think it I think he does. Don't fuck up my crime scene. Well, don't fuck up my don't crime scene, boy. Trick. I'll be nearby. If you need anything, just ask. All right, well, let's have a look around. Let's play the recording. This okay, message Lieutenant. is the hope of a people, but it is also a warning. We will fight for our rights because we believe our cause is just. No human will live in peace until we are free. Now you know who we are and what we want. We are alive, and we demand our freedom. That's, that's a fair time. demand. Deviants say RA-9 will set them free. This android seems to have that objective. Yeah, he did. What clues do we have? Pupil reflection. Unit, spare part. Prototyped. Ah, Marcus. I identified its model and serial number. Anything else I should know? Well, I found out who the owner is. No. It's got a registered owner. Nothing. Didn't think of telling him that. All right, what do we got? Got a cap. Okay. <coughs> I like this, by the way, that I. Get to pull off this amazing thing and then I have to come back and investigate there's a different person. I kind of like that. It's a cool way of doing it. Oh, I'm missing something. Here. CCTV. There we go. 
didn't break in. They didn't break in? No, no signs of forced entry. There are cameras in the hallway. The staff would have seen what was happening. Why did they let him in? Maybe they didn't check the cameras. Or maybe they did. Turn the chair. Ah, it was an android to let us in. Androids in the kitchen. There's no evidence that they were involved, but we didn't know what else to do with them. All right, let's do it. Let's rock in like a badass. Come on. Interrogate. Look for a reaction to spot. Model. State your model. Model GB300. Serial number 336-445-581. What is your function? I am a broadcast operator. Memory. Has anybody accessed your memory recently? Not to my knowledge. Witness. Were you present when the deviants broke in? I do not remember. Diagnostic. diagnostic. All systems fully operational. Contact. Have been in contact with any other androids recently? Only station androids in the normal course of my function. One of you saw the attack on the surveillance cameras yep. and said nothing. Which means there's a deviant in this room. And I'm going to find out which it is. Yep. Why should you all be destroyed if only one is deviant? Turn yourself in or two innocent androids will be shut down because of you. I kind of feel like it's the middle one. You're going to be switched off. We're going to search your memory and tear you apart piece by piece for analysis. You're going to be destroyed. Do you hear me? Destroyed! God, I don't know. I Did don't you know. Give yourself up? Maybe I can convince the humans not to destroy you. Bluff. The deviants have just been caught. They gave you up. There's no point in lying. We know everything. I feel like it's the middle one. Probe memory. No memory. No memory. Shit. Torture. Component 8451 regulates the heartbeat. Without this module, you'll shut down in exactly 63 seconds. I could put it back, but you just have to tell me the truth. Are you the deviant? Are uh, you the deviant? You tell me, son. I don't know. I really don't oh, know. Stupid. I know it's you. You're just a fucking deviant. Go on, admit it. There. Okay, there we go. <gasps> uh oh. Shit. 
shit. I don't know what to do. Get the knife out of my hand. Get the fucking knife out. Oh my god, oh my god, oh my god, oh my god. Come on. Come on. Go. Shit. Come on. Come on. Get it. Where the fuck is Hank? Oh shit. Hank's survival probability is 40. Jesus Christ. Good thing you were here, otherwise I'd... Connor. Ah, uh, sorry dude. Well, at least he cared, I guess. I, m I mean, that's a step in the right direction for us, I guess. Because <laughs> with the other Connors, it didn't seem like he really gave a shit. God dang it. I'm interested in this game. This game's taken, like, a really interesting turn. It'll be interesting in the end to see whether they get their, uh, whether we get the freedoms that, that they're requesting. Or whether they all just get rebooted and start again. Alright. Ooh, got the hiccups. Who are you? Hello? I'm looking for Rose. Is she here? What do you want with her? I need to talk to her. She doesn't want to talk. Go away. How do you know that she doesn't want to talk? You're not her. Please, I really need to see I her. I are. I'm Rose. <clears throat> what can I do for you? I was told you could help us. Help you? Yeah, help us. Come on. It's better if we talk inside. You better not be another crazy person. I've dealt with too many of them. <coughs> My God. I think we can trust them. Uh, distrust? Be careful. If it feels wrong, we get out fast, okay? I'm with you. Come in. What's your name? Alice. She's running a fever. We've spent the last few nights outside. Yeah, it's been pretty cold outside. She's exhausted. In case There's you haven't a noticed. There's room upstairs. You can put her to bed and I'll bring her something to eat. Adam, will you show them upstairs? Oh, 
Well, he doesn't have a gun or an axe or anything, so... I think if we go, I think the big guy can help us this time around. Whereabouts upstairs? Here? No? Here? Where? There. I was right. Thank you. Come on, Alice. Bedtime. Go to bed, girl. Here we go. Nice. Talk her in. I'm fine, Gar. We can't stop because of me. We've got to get across. We can the stop for a little bit. Reassure. You need a rest. Get a good night's sleep and we'll set off again tomorrow. Why do humans hate us? We didn't do anything wrong. They're just scared. Maybe they're just scared. People are always scared of what they don't know. Why can't we just talk to each other? They'd see we're not bad. Uh, optimism. Maybe I can't tell her the good. truth. I feel bad. I do. I feel like this kid needs I all the support like, and optimism. I made you Rose's world famous spaghetti. You world famous spaghetti. There's something for her fever. Thank you. I'll get these washed and dried. Okay. Come on, eat. eat something. You haven't had anything since we left. Promise me you'll try? I'll be downstairs if you need anything. Get some right. sleep. Tomorrow, Let's close the curtains. There we go. I'll stay with her a while. You'll stay with her a while? Okay. I trust him with her. Even if like even if my chick dies, at least she's safe with him. That's like a my main concern is keeping that kid safe after everything that she's been through. I didn't get your name. I'm Kara. This is my son. Adam. Thank you very much. I appreciate your hospitality. You know that already. Come and have a seat, Kara. So are you going to tell me what a deviant's doing in the snow with a little girl? <sighs> I'm going to be sincere. Her father was beating her. When I saw what was happening, something snapped inside of me. All of a sudden I felt like her life was more important than mine. I had yeah. to protect her. So we ran away. I understand. Thank you. Why out? Are you helping us? Most humans hate androids. My people were often made to feel their lives were worthless. Some survived, but only because they found others who helped them along the way. Are there many deviants? We're not the first ones to come here. These past few weeks, we've seen more and, and more. I don't know what's going on, but something's happening. Something is happening. We need to go We've across heard the border. You help androids cross the border. Can you help us? 
the only way is over the river, and it's mostly frozen in winter. It's very risky. And after that android speech on TV, everybody's on edge. It's probably safer for you to stay here until things settle down. We have no choice. I can't keep hiding like this. Alice needs to feel safe and have a normal life. We have to get across that border. No matter what. Please. You've got to help us. Rose, come quickly. Jesus Christ, who are you? What is going on? They better not be chopping up like androids or something. What's going on? It's Mary. She just shut down. Wait, wait, wait. What? Show, 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 show. We escaped together. Oh, shit. We used to talk about what we would do once we got across the border. I loved her. I loved her more than anything. Shit. What will I do without her? Let's let them be. Hey, what are you doing down there? You should be resting. I wasn't sleepy. Stay. She can stay. It's fine. She needs to she needs to see some of the horror. She needs to see why it's important that we're doing what we're doing. Want to stay in her room any longer? You all right, Carol? Yeah. Yes, I'm fine. All right, we need a plan. We need a plan. Not after what those deviants did today. It's too dangerous. Do you know what will happen if the police find them here? We'll go to prison, Mom. Do you understand me? We won't let prison that happen. Adam. We've already talked about this. I, uh, no! I won't back down this time. You're gonna ruin our lives, and for what? For a bunch of machines? They are not machines! They are alive! I'm alive! You're alive! They... They're nothing! And none God. of this be happening... People in this world are dicks. I will not stand for that kind of talk. I'm not going to prison because you want to help these freaks. That is enough, Adam. That's enough. Shit just got real. My God. Don't mind him. Sometimes he just boils over. He's kind of right, it's though. Hard. You're taking a big fucking away. risk. But he's a fine boy. And not just like a small kind of... I'll go see about getting you Not kind of a, a, a small kind of air eh, risk. You're taking a massive risk. You stay here. I won't be And he's right. If you get caught, you'll be fucked. Alright. What's the plan? We need a plan. We always need a plan, guys. Big guy. He doesn't have a plan either. Wait for Rose, look around, check on Alice.
Is she all right? You know what happened back there, don't you? You know that you don't want to tell me? Insist. I thought we didn't keep secrets from each other. If I tell you, you won't love me anymore. What? You know that's not true. What happened? Talk to Adam. Where is he? On the couch. Here we go. He's not going to be very welcoming to us. I, I, I know that. Explain. We don't want to cause any problems for you and your mother. We'll leave as soon as we can. All right, what now? Oh, is she gonna like bring the cops or something? The police. It's the police. Uh, and they know we're here. We have to open the door. Okay. I knew this was gonna happen. Uh, I knew it. Hide. Okay, what else? What else? What else? Uh oh. Uh oh. Hide evidence. There's one left. Hide the evidence. Go, 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 go. Open the door. Reassure him. Just keep calm, Adam, and everything will be all right. All right, let's go. Let's go. It's showtime. Sorry to disturb Hello. you. We've had reports of androids in the area. With all this deviant business going no on, androids here. Do you mind if I ask you a few questions? Yeah, of course. May I come in? Uh, of course. Good evening, young man. Good evening. What can we help you with, sir? Would you like a cup of coffee? I'd love one. Have you noticed anything unusual recently? Any unexpected visitors? No. Anything unusual? No, nothing nah. in particular. Nothing unusual. Is anyone else in the house? Alice. There's my daughter. She's asleep upstairs. Uh, yes. We used to for helping in the garden, but we got rid of it. Please, sir, uh, have a seat. Have a seat. Have a sit down. Thanks. You're welcome. I make a good bloody cup of coffee. Best in town. He's not suspicious at all. Good. His suspicion level is at zero percent, which is good. Oh god, don't open the drawers. 
Uh oh. What's your name, son? Adam. M my name is Adam. Is everything all right, Adam? Yeah, everything's great. The the androids. They. He's just upset. He's just shaken up about this deviant business. Do you know anything about deviants? Have you seen any? No. No. I, I, I haven't seen anything. I better go. Thanks for the coffee. You're Have a welcome. Nice evening. Is somebody else oh, in the no. house? That's a dog. It's the dog. He sleeps in the laundry room. Sorry for the inconvenience. Good evening, ma'am. Good evening, Adam. Ooh. Close call. Jesus. He's gone. It's okay, Alice. We'll be safe now. Nicely done. It's Rose. Very nicely done. Get yourselves ready. We leave tonight. Yeah. Holy shit, I actually managed to handle that fairly well. I, I, I'm surprised. I usually do not manage these kind of things very well. I'm usually very horrible at making all these splits, put a split decision split second decisions so i'm really I'm, I'm hey i'm proud of how that went but anyway i'm gonna leave this episode here i feel like we're getting into like the latter half of this game like we're only gonna get a couple more episodes and then that's gonna be it um which i'm kind of i'm looking forward to but at the same time i'm kind of sad that it's coming to an end but anyway we're gonna keep on going uh in the next episode but for now Thank you guys so much for watching. Don't forget to give this video a thumbs up. Don't forget to favorite it. Don't forget to subscribe if you have not already, guys. Helps me out a lot. There are links to social medias in the description box. And as always, there's a link to propyjn.com down below. But thank you guys. And until next time, I'm YouTube's PropyJN. Peace out.